Hello everyone and welcome to exam B. In this video, I am going to share you again the 10 questions for the year 2020 SEBI phase 1. And this is the part 4. Earlier to this, for entire 2020 year, the descriptive question and MCQ questions are there on our YouTube channel. Also, for year 2020, previously three videos were made and they were live there so go and watch those video before coming to watch this video or you can watch them afterwards as well but the entire point is complete those videos as well now let's start with the questions i will show you the 10 questions and then you have to attempt all those 10 questions the answers to all those questions will be given at the end and you have to evaluate your attempt you have to give yourself a plus one for every correct answer and minus 0.25 for every incorrect answer so this particular question is related to a python code and you have to understand this python code and just give the correct answer whether this d1 equal to d2 will be true or false or will give us any error now second question is again on the python and this particular thing is going to ask you that if d is assigned some values and then d john is there so what will be the correct output question number 33 is related to shell scripts and uh, there you have to check this command and just let us know the purpose of this particular command next question is just a simple statement and you have to just identify that particular statement is true or false this is very easy yet conceptual and static Question number 35 is related to the cyber securities, uh, not specifically cyber security, but network audit and system audit under cyber security topic. So here you have to identify that what this particular uh, risk violation happens when these kinds of things do. So again, conceptual but static question. Question number 36 is related to a file permission. Like if uh, we give this kind of uh, permission to a file, what kind of operations we can do and what this D indicates actually. It's a super user or directory or what it is. So you have to identify what is D. Then the next question is related to a statement where you have to check this particular command and answer whether it's going to return true or false or yes or no. Then the 38th question is related to data warehousing where you are going to be asked on some concepts of drill down, dicing, slicing, mining and roll up. Just identify which particular thing is being explained in the question statement and pick the correct answer. Now the 39th question is related to the Unix commands and you have to identify which particular command that is being shown here is doing the uh, purpose like what is the purpose of having these uh, uh, RM file 1, file 2. Now, the last question for this video is a statement based question with a fill in the blank. So, you have to fill the correct uh, concept in this particular statement. And uh, this is again a question from the auditing, uh, which is under the cyber security topic. Now, this time is for the uh, answers revelation. So, if you haven't uh, attempted all the question, pause the video, go to that particular question, attempt that question, and then come back later and find the correct answers. Once you are done with all the questions, these are the answers for all the 10 questions. And uh, give yourself a plus 1 and minus 2.5 for every correct and incorrect uh, uh, attempt respectively. If you are scoring less than 5, it's high time guys, back up yourself start preparing very hard if you are getting anything in between six to seven you need to revise the concepts you are getting an average score if you are getting anything between eight to ten you are in a safe land and you will be able to survive phase one easily so this was my analysis for these 10 questions hope you like this thing if you like this thing please do it the like button subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon in order to not miss any update from our site prepare 50 percent faster with iExambi with uh, our courses that are there in www.iExambi.com just go and watch our sebi it comprehensive course as well you can enroll for the demo package for free now if you have any doubt you can mention that in the comment section also you can reach out to us at hello at examby.com or on the number that is being flashed on the screen so that was all from my side till i bring the next video keep practicing and stay updated